Remember now. You must. You must kill. Why you ever wanted to land on a planet like this in the first place, I'll never know. This is getting on my nerves. I hate to think one kind of an animal makes a noise like that. Yeah, they're getting closer. Yeah, it's all the more reason to stop talking and get on with the job. Just you listen to me, Corey. I know my orders were to let you have full reign, and you've certainly taken advantage of that. But as captain of this expedition, my first responsibility is to get this ship off the ground. So just up the chair. Some other time. Hmm? Bring that ring. Well, how's it going? Oh, it's slow. Blair back melted the retaining bolt. It's a solid lump of tiny. Uh, one bit three. If we don't shoot off soon, we won't make the rendezvous with the freight, you know? If we're not in the pickup orbit, they won't wait. You make it, Larry. Here you are. I'm doing the best I can. I didn't want to touch down this lousy plant in the first place, remember? Let's not start that again. Just get on with the job, would you? What the devil's Garvey? You should be back by now. I'll be here. Let's screw driver, will you? I should get some of it free. Look at it. Useless. Get me a spare, will you? No, in the ship. Ah, oh, it's no good, Tori. Needn't bother with a spare. Just not going to be able to fix it. Him or you? You didn't give him a chance. You shut him down like an animal. You just shut him down! <laughs> a 
Vargas. Vargas? Careful, don't prick yourself with it. Or you'll end up the way Garvey is. I'll have to kill you. What do you mean? Let's get back into the ship. What about his personal effects? All right. Family. But hurry up. I didn't intend to tell you anything. But since we're stuck on this planet and Garvey's dead, there are some facts that you're entitled to know. Yeah. Jeff Garvey's dead. And we weaved through together for the last ten years. And now he's dead, and you killed him. You better explain that fact and make it good. Sit down and take a look at this. Space Security Service, licensed to kill. That's right. They'll talk me out. This other document gives me the authority to enlist the aid of any person, civil or military. You were just enlisted. From now on, Lowry, you can take your orders from me. Yeah, all right, all right. But I don't fully understand. Better fill in a few details. All right. I suppose you've heard of the Daleks. Daleks invaded Earth a thousand years ago. That's right. Well, they haven't been active in our galaxy for some time now, but that doesn't mean they've exactly been sitting around. In the last 500 years, they've gained control of over 70 planets in Ninth Galactic System, and of 40 more in the constellation of Miros. I don't see why that should concern us. I mean, they're both millions of light years away from our galaxy. Hmm, that's what we all thought. But about a week ago, we had a report from the captain of a space freighter. His navigator spotted a a spaceship of a type never before used in our system. He saw it only for a second, but he gave us a good description. So, what he described was a Dalek spaceship. <laughs> Freighter XN2, Freighter XN2, come in, please. Come in, please. Can you make it work? It's got to work. It may have been damaged in the crash. We must keep on trying. Is that to the link pulses? I know what I'm doing. Right, all right, so the link pulses work. There could be something else wrong with it. What about the vergometer? Have you tested that? Without that, you'd never break through the atmosphere. How can I possibly test that? We've just got to take a chance that it hasn't been damaged. Freighter XN2, Freighter XN2, come in, please. Come in, please. Are you sure we can't repair this ship? Well, not a chance. Oh. So you think that the Daleks have established some sort of base here, is that it? It could be. This is the most hostile planet in the universe. People from other civilizations avoid it. I suddenly had a hunch that this might make an ideal place for any secret preparations that the Daleks wanted to make. That's why we brought this ship down here. Did you tell anybody else about this hunch of yours? No one. Not even your commander. I just asked for a couple of men and a small rocket. I didn't even tell him what for. Then why are you telling me? Because of this. A form from a Varga plant. A thing, part animal, part vegetable. Looks like a cactus. The poison attacks the brain. 